I'm Shannon Ogden with your Denver 7 update. As expected, the case and death count have declined from the record high reported yesterday. 6,500 cases have been confirmed, and that is 300 more than yesterday, and 250 people now have died. And crucially, the rate of hospital admissions appears to have steadied to a level that our doctors and nurses can manage. And tonight, frontline workers are giving us a rare glimpse into their daily lives, providing us actually the first footage we have seen of coronavirus units in Colorado. Contact 7's Jennifer Kowaleski reports. The aide is requesting something for pain. For the first time, we're getting a look inside UC Health at University of Colorado Hospital in Aurora, the largest hospital in the state treating more coronavirus patients than anywhere else. This nurse is working with a presumed positive case inside the ICU. Okay, you can unbuckle. And then there's the COVID-19 unit, All right. an area of the hospital sectioned off okay, am I covered back here? for only patients with the virus. What we're seeing overall are patients who are presenting with acute respiratory illness, and then some of them are very, very sick. So about 35% or 40% or so of the patients that we've admitted to the hospital have required critical care. And most of those patients um, have been on ventilators. Dr. Richard Zane is one of the ER doctors on the front lines of the outbreak. Do you have enough ventilators? For right now, uh, we have enough ventilators, yes. When we last spoke to you, you talked about you were seeing an initial surge in patients. Where is that surge right now? Well, it feels as though um, we've really leveled off from the uh, number of patients who are being admitted. Molly says they are starting to see fewer patients with COVID-19 symptoms. It doesn't mean we should let our guard down. Things are very urgent. I don't want to in any way uh, let people think that we are out of the woods. I think we understand this disease much better. When we first talked to Dr. Zane late last month, he told us they were days, not weeks away from running out of protective gear. But he says that supply is improving. We're in a better place. We have ample PPE to take care of our patients and take care of the community. Are you still reusing masks and gloves and gowns? We are definitely repurposing uh, masks. I'm using UV light and also reconditioning. What do you think is the most important message for the public to hear right now? Stay the course and social distancing is the single most important thing that you can do for the state of Colorado, for your family, uh, for Coloradans, your neighbors. A little bit of encouraging news there. Thank you for watching this Denver 7 update. Make sure to download the Denver 7 app for your smartphone to get breaking news and alerts around the clock. I'm Shannon Ogden.